This is legitimately how my physics binder is organized. This is me in my prime. <laughs> Your move, colleges. <laughs> I don't know what I want to do when I grow up. I don't know what's gonna happen in the next five years at all. I don't get those people my age who have already planned out everything. Like, they came out of the womb like, Okay, I'm gonna be a doctor. And they just start treating themselves and making sure they're a healthy newborn. They know exactly what they want to do and what's gonna happen that's just... That's so... Raven. I've made a video in a while, and if you forgot why, you were probably subscribed to this channel is because of this little thing. And the reason I haven't made a video is because I've been trying to get my grades to go in the upwards direction for once. Believe it or not, I don't do this full time. That's the other Pew YouTuber. Go check out PewDiePie. It's really underrated. With college right around the corner, or university if you live in not America, it's a lot of pressure to get good grades. Like, I want them to accept me, but they better accept everybody except me, you feel? But it's not just grades. No, no, no. Colleges like students that do all sorts of stuff for their little Hunger Games competition. They want a well-rounded person, so all this weight I lost was for nothing. You can't just do, like, the in-class stuff. You gotta join those extracurricular activities. The Key Club, the French Culture Club, the... Caucasian Culture Club, spelled with all K's, so it's catchier. What do they even do at some of these clubs? What happens at the Black Student Association? All right, everyone, quick roll call. You're black? <laughs> Perfect. I'm black, of course. He's he's half black, but we're gonna let it slide. MLK would have wanted this. He died for this light skin to exist. Calm down, Jabal. Just let it slide. Jamal! Don't feed the stereotype, Jamal! Are there gonna be so many options for what you want to be when you grow up? And I still don't have the slightest clue. Like, what did kids even say a hundred years ago? I want to be an astronaut. Nope, not a thing yet. Also, why do you keep saying these things? You're a child laborer. <laughs> One thing's for sure, I know I'm not gonna find the cure for anything. They already took the easy stuff. Coughs, runny nose, itchy eyes. What do we get left with? AIDS. Just, 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 just let me, just let me help you stop sneezing for a little bit. Don't worry about the AIDS. Personally, I think the coolest job ever would be motivational speaking, but one, I'm not very motivational. Two, I'm not very good at speaking. I can't do either of the two things in the name. Come on! I'm a firefighter, but I'm not really a big fighting guy, you know? <laughs> I just kind of like soothe the fire, just like calm it down, you know, ask it why it's angry. Just like, just tell, you know, just have a conversation. You know? With motivational speaking, you're going around, talking to people, making people feel better about themselves, inspiring people, freaking, yeah! You gotta have a story, you know? Like every motivational speaker has a cool story, how they, how they just, uh, just overcame something difficult in their lives. I can't just go up there and be like, I was forced to grow up in the slums of middle class suburbia. <laughs> the reason something like that seems cool to me is because I just really want a job that has to do with making an impact in people's lives. You know, I don't want, I want to like go, like do things. I don't want to just like, uh, Susan, where are the copy? Shut up, Susan! Get, uh, sorry, Susan! The reason I like YouTube so much is because of the interaction and, the, like, the the messages I get from people saying that my videos help them through a hard time or even stop them from taking their own life. Okay, first of all, on that subject... This is ice cream. <laughs> a drumstick, to be exact. Now, if I could open the freaking... If I was more of a man... This thing is freaking awesome. If you're gonna give this to me and you tell me that I can't eat the rest of it until I eat the top of this. The top is covered in nuts. I hate nuts. Freaking nuts, dude. I, I don't know. They're not even that... No, they're not good. They're crunchy. Ew. If you like nuts, pick up just something that you do not like on the top of this ice cream cone. Let's move on. So I don't like nuts, but in order to eat the rest of this delicious drumstick, you're telling me that I have to eat from the top and I cannot take off the nuts. If you're able to make it through this tiny little part, it's not even that big. It's actually really unimportant and high school. If you decide to throw away your ice cream cone because you don't like this little part up here that tastes like crap, you're gonna miss out on this delicious drumstick. If you're able to make it through this, then you get to enjoy well, I've done this! You've got so much more in life ahead of you than the crap on the top. Come at me, Josh Sunquist! That was pretty okay! What about the college thing? I know it's not necessary to know what I want to do when I grow up and what I want to freaking go, where I want to go to college and whatever. It'd just, it just be nice to, you know, know. You know? No? No? You don't know? Okay. Some people are like, you know, Nathan, if you upload more videos, you could be doing this full time. And, you know, I, I mean, I get that, but I, I, I kind of want, and no offense to any of my YouTube friends who are doing YouTube full time, um, I kind of want a real job. <laughs> so I will try to upload more often, but junior year really is more important than a freaking website, so please try to understand. You can follow me on Vine if you want to see more of me, if you love to hate yourself for doing things, or you can follow me on Twitter, because... I'm gonna start begging if you don't. Seriously though, it's the only thing that makes me feel alive. I, I, please follow me on Twitter. And lastly, please donate to my Kickstarter so I can afford college. Falcon hug. Falcon. Oh. With my luck, I'm probably gonna end up accidentally marrying a girl who doesn't like puns. That would be unring bearable. <laughs> uh.